Thank you. And take your seat and sign the oath. You may also pass on your documents to the clerk for him to be able to cross-check with what is in our position. So we'll start, uh, Honorable Dwale, uh, by asking you introductory questions. Uh, tell us your name, your education background, your work experience, your competences. Uh, that lead to your suitability for the appointment that you have uh, had? Uh, thank you, Mr. Speaker and honorable members of the appointment committee. Speaker, on the onset, uh, I want to thank you and uh, this committee and the entire House for giving me this opportunity to appear for vetting for the second time. I also want to thank His Excellency the President for according me a second opportunity in a different ministry to serve the people of Kenya. Mr. Speaker, I grew up in Garissa. I went to school there, Garissa High School, Boys Town Primary School, Moy Forces Academy, I did my first uh, graduate uh, degree in Moore University, Bachelor of Education Economics, and finally I did my master's in business administration in 2011 at Jomo Kenyatta University of Science and Technology. I s worked in the private sector. I was a businessman before I joined politics in 2007. I served the people of Dujis between 2008 and 2013. During the Grand Coalition government, I was an assistant minister for livestock. I served with you, Mr. Speaker, in that uh, government as the minister for foreign affairs. And between 2013 and 2014, the people of Garza Township gave me an opportunity to serve them again and again to serve them between 2017 and 2022. And again, they gave me an opportunity to serve them between 2022 for about two, three months. So I served as a member of parliament for fourth consecutive terms, which the last one I did not complete because the president in his wisdom uh, poached me from the legislature and to help him in the executive. I was the first majority leader under the 2010 constitution. I served for eight years. I led in making sure that the government business uh, during that period sailed through over 150 bills were enacted, had my signature, and Mr. Speaker, I had a wonderful time working with a cross-section of leaders from different parts of our country, from different uh, 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 gender and age, and from different uh, political formation. 